Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be playing an arcade version of Mike Tyson's Punch-Out. So let's put in our name as Mac. M-A-C, enter. Let's, I'm going to do each. I may do this in the four or five parts. So yeah, and I'm going to use, well not going to, I'm going to try to use, never mind about that. So let's just beat Glass Joe. He is like, like one of the easiest characters to beat. I managed to beat him blindfolded. And I'm using the mobile controls down below where you, you see the plus sign. Damage. And he's not down. I saw the star. There's six more hearts and bomb paint. Ooh, he only gets up on the one. Pause button because I have an itch. Super punch. And he's down for the second knockdown. And that's the third knockdown. Just to speed up the process. One down, two to go. Two down, one to go. Instead of having to like punch, it, if he doesn't uppercut, you can just wait. And if you have a star, you can just hit start, and it will knock him down no matter what after you do the dodge. I'm gonna show you. No, I'm just gonna get knocked down. It's like a speed on strat that I was trying to show you, but it didn't work. Fast forward. Ooh, that was quick timing. Ooh, a star on the first punch. I'll take that. Yes, sir. Bam! One. Second knockdown, okay? I hope when he does his charge, I can knock him down. I really hope he does his charge, because that would be the fastest time I beat him. No, I messed up, no! Oh, I could have beaten him up so fast. Oh yeah, watch this. Instead of doing a cutscene, the training cutscene, it goes extremely fast. So I'm not gonna speed it up. Boom. It like it's like frames of the cutscene on the file code. So they just cut it, like save the last picture basically and then 
It's like doing Lego animation. Like good Lego animation or play animation, things like that. That's what they basically did. So they skipped that. So I'm gonna do the next two fights. Cause that the video is kind of short in my opinion. Swing. Fun. One, two, three, four, five, back up. I don't know if that was a fun, I don't know how I'm practicing speedrunning the uh, first three fighters. And I could have had it, uh, I'm, I'm disappointed in myself. I punched way too early. There's like a little strat where you can hear it when you hear it like the and stop. You wanna hit left and right, but you gotta time it perfectly. Oh, King Hippo was my last. I'm working on Bald Bull blindfolded. But that's gonna be take a long time because per a professional, I forgot his name. Um It took him like a year just to practice. And I've not I've been doing much practicing because I've been doing too busy moving. And that's a KO right there. Oh, great tiger. I'm gonna end the fight on great. This is the last fighter. I'm gonna let it punch me one. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, Exactly 24. A 24 but it's you can't get one digit. Sorry, I have itches for the mosquitoes. Boom! One, two. I'm gonna wait till the 30s, 2.30 so I can show you how to properly do that. You just wanna keep on holding down. Knockout! Well, technical knockout. Hope you guys like the video. Well, I'm gonna just do, maybe I'll do 7, 6, and 1. Okay, yeah, this bulb, I thought, for some weird reason, I thought Ray Tiger was the seventh fighter that should fight. Oh, nope, it's Bald Bull. I got kept the star, and I knocked him down with under 20 seconds. Five, six. Seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven.
Sorry for these like notifications. I have hit the bell. Oh crap! I hit the bell. I share YouTube account with my nephew, so. Yes, I don't have to do the bull card. I mostly fail on mobile when I do. I have to do the ball card. Well, okay, this is part one out of part. I don't know, but hope you guys like the video. <laughs> please hit the like button, please hit the subscribe button, and please leave a comment down below. Goodbye.